So today we're looking at Papazzi hosting for MCPE servers. Indeed, we are. And as you can tell, we're on their website, which is poppotsy.com. Um, it's a really beautiful website. It's changed. And um, as you can see, if you scroll down to the bottom, there's some plans. And they're really good prices, and it's really good like hardware that they have. It's very always very flat, fast, and fluent, and very minimal problems, if any. All right, so should we like get started? Or do you want to like it's show the panel? Um, yeah, we're gonna show you uh, what you get when you purchase one, like the control panel where you can view all your ops and bands and plugins and etc. And then also just how smooth it is in game and just a feel for yep. what they offer. All right, all right. So let's log in. So they have for three plans. First one is the micro for eight dollars a month. You get ten users, unlimited bandwidth, uh, all that good stuff. Small is most popular, and it's sixteen bucks a month, and that gets you twenty users. Whoops. So ten, twenty, and then thirty users. You got to pay twenty-four a month, which is very good pricing. Indeed, it is. All right, so now let's log in into our panel because we, of course, have a server with him. Enter your email, your PayPal email, is it? And a password that they send you to your email. Yeah, you buy it with PayPal. It's very easy. You can do it all from a mobile device. You don't have to be using a computer, which is a very nice part of it. Mm-hmm. So once you log in, you're introduced into the dashboard, which is coming soon. Um, to like see all the plugins and stuff, you just click on the server, and here you'll see like your settings. So server properties, right here you can see your server IP. So that's the number that you use to join. So you can give that to your friends mm -hmm. and type it in. Join the port is also important. Uh, it's under the server. And then you can name it and give message of the day that displays when a user joins. Indeed. And you can also change the privacy to public or private, just in case you want to have a, like just your friends and no one else can join. The difference between that is the whitelist, if it's on private, then only people whose usernames are in the whitelist can join. But if it's public, then anyone can join, whether they're in the list or not. Mm -hmm. The ban list is like people who you ban, and it's it's really nifty. You can like add people or remove people manually. Anybody who's in this list is not allowed to join your server, so if they try to join, they'll just be kicked out instantly. Yep. So for griefers, for hackers, whoever. And here is the ops, where all the op people are. And uh, just in case you don't know what opt means, it's just all the access to like the commands. Operators. Operators, indeed. For sure. Maybe. So. That would be like the owners of the server, so like you, and if you had a staff running it, you could put them in here. Or you can use the plugins. Just and like then we have the plugins, which I don't even know how many there is. There's quite yeah, a bunch. There's so many since the last time we've checked. There's, yeah, anything you could need pretty much. They're always adding more too, so it's very Keep on the lookout. Um, so we're gonna show you the one-click install, should we? Yeah, all right, so I'll go ahead and join my server. All right, so what plugin should I install? What you do is you hit play. You probably already noticed, but in case you don't, you hit play and then edit, and then a little button pops up called external. And then you just put in your IP that's listed in the dashboard and the port, and then say add server call it whatever you want. Once you do that, then you just open it up and it should connect pretty seamlessly. Yep. 
Alright, so I'm in. Oh, there's some random people on here. Oh. It is public, am I? Yeah, it's public. Alright. <laughs> well, well, that'll be interesting. Just don't tell them we're recording. Right. Right. Um. <laughs> oh, he's talking to me. Alright, let's keep moving. Alright, so on the website, there's the one click install to install plugins. So right now, I'm going to install World Edit Err. Um, what other ones did you want to do? Do world edit in simple worlds. We'll just demo those. Simple worlds start with an S. Here it is. All right, and I'll check that one too. And all you have to do is save and restart. Yep. And oh, bam, your plugins that stuff's been saved. Right now, it's probably installing, doing all the technical stuff. After you do that. It'll take a second. It'll kick everyone off because it's restarting the server. And then pretty soon it'll pop back on and you can join and you'll have all your plugins installed. Indeed. No hassle. It does it all for you. Yeah. That's really nice. The other upside of having one click install is you virtually cannot break your server because it's just on or off. And you can also uh, configure them. Alright, so I've joined again. And open up the chat. To do commands, you hit the forward slash and then whatever command. You can do help to see a list of commands. Mm -hmm. So I'll just do that. World edit is two forward slashes and then. Here's the list of all things you can do. There's so, many so I'll oh, there's so many commands yeah. for world edit. It's crazy. Like it's really good for building and copying stuff, and like it, lots of modern pocket edition builders so, use it. So yeah, you can read all about it on the wiki or whatever. But I'll just do a quick little demo. Uh, the iron hoe in creative inventory or survival. Uh. It's basically like you're selecting blocks. So the first one you'll do is you'll break it. And then it'll say first position set to such and such. There you are. And then if you just want to make a little box, you can build it up. And then instead of breaking it, you just tap the next block. It'll say second position set to so and so. All right. And then one of the commands is slash slash replace. So since air is what I want to be replacing I'll put zero or you can type out air you can if you know the numbers for stuff you can type out the numbers but it's often easier just to do apparently I'm not the names of things okay well yeah I'll fix that, that in just a second all right so say I want to fill it up with like stone I'll just write stone so you're replacing whatever you're replacing and then what you're replacing it with and then you just hit go and it'll say 141 blocks been changed and it see it rendered all this stone right here where I selected all right let me op you yep do slash op and then the player name so that's him there we go it says he's now opt you can set the time so oh you just did I, it yep <laughs> slash time set and then the time you want it number all right so that's basic overview um another cool plugin is simple worlds which allows you to ha have like multiple worlds running on a server so people can like teleport between them because right now the worlds are very small so having multiple worlds is very a very very important for a server all right so main uh, command is simple worlds. There we go. Alright, it shows you a big long list of stuff you can do. Uh, so, we will generate a simple world and then load it and then teleport to it. Very and there's other plugins easy. that works with it too. Yeah, there's other plugins that you can use for alternate generators there's tons of things you can do so i'll type in the shortcut thing it's just swg for simple worlds generate and then let's see it's your seed 
So there's two, one, two, three. And generator name, I think flat is the default. Yep. But it's actually not flat. And then your level name. So I'll call it uh, demo one. All right, so generate seed flat demo one. Give it a couple seconds, it'll say level generated. And then simple worlds load demo one. And it'll say loaded. All right, so normally when you teleport, you do slash TP and then a player or coordinates. But if you do TP W colon, then you can write your world and it'll teleport you between worlds if you have simple worlds installed. Yep. So I'll write demo one and it just teleported me to another world. And I can teleport so him by doing slash TP iOS underscore Minecraft 22. Bam. So yeah, you can just teleport to me too. So very essential, very easy, lots of fun to mess with. Oh, fire doesn't work. Oh. This might be like spawn or something. Or spawn oh yeah, something. that's right. All right. Safety first. So there's tons of plugins to guard against griefing and explosions. much everything you would need doesn't like trees mm. it's pocket mine yeah pocket mine's buggy but other than that it's it's pretty cool software uh, so anything else you'd like to add covered a couple plugins um we'll take a look I'm at the config show them the big of each big uh, bad hammer oh no uh, the config of each like plugin that you install, you can actually configure it. Oh, and the so uh, website. Can ban people. So see, he was blowing up everything. We don't want him to be blowing up everything, no. so we just banned him, and he cannot join until I unban him. So if you take a look at the website here, uh, after you check it and it reloads, there's a little like blue configure that you can click, and you can like configure it. And you can there see like the auto loads, it automatically loads the world. There's so much going on. It's really, it'd be difficult to cover everything in one video, but we're just giving a rough overview. Mm -hmm. You can ban by name or by IP, so just another idea there. And there's so many right, so I've to choose from, it's phenomenal. I've unbanned you, so you can join again if you'd like. No. Good. All right. You, you broke my heart. Oh, just kidding. I'm, I'm just sure you'll be alright. Yeah. Your heart's very strong. <laughs> 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 um. All right. So. Right. Uh, what? What? Oh. If you've really messed up your world and you want to restart, uh back in the panel there's a world category you can destroy it it'll just destroy the default world here i, I it can won't show destroy them. it won't destroy all your simple world added additional I'll just like world. destroy the spawn guess well the whole original world yeah well that world you spawn and then if there's any plugin that's giving you problems or it's just not working right or you just want to reset it uh, down at the bottom you can hit system and then restart the server that totally shuts down the hardware and powers it back up so or if you have any like other problems you're experiencing and you can't see a way to fix it there's a support tab at the website and they'll yep. take them take you to like their support and you can uh, open a new ticket and Register. You can read all the frequently asked questions too. Those are helpful. Yeah, those are really helpful too. And if not, you can just like tweet Papazzi. Or, or Papazzi LLC, the company. The company itself. Alright, so that's about it. Wrapping it up. Yep. 
our personal experience have been great with this. Uh, we use it to host some servers, and it's a really great service. It is. Really easy. It's largely focused on hassle-free. It's really nice to not have to mess with files and not have to be worried about breaking everything by doing something wrong. Indeed. So that about What's wraps it up. What's your favorite part about it? What's your favorite part about it? Yep. We recommend it to you guys, so go check it out. What's your favorite part about it? My favorite part? Yeah. Is that I don't have to, like, see if it's still alive or not. So they have to check if it's still alive. And I know it's safe with Pop Potsy. It just works. It works. It's a lot like Apple, actually. Is it? I think it is. Yeah. Maybe. In your mind. Well, <laughs> I might be biased, but I think it's very nice. You are very biased with Apple. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's in my name, so it's kind of hard to change oh, it. Oh, uh, yeah. You big fan. Alright, so we hope you check this guy out. His service is very excellent, very worth your time checking out. Indeed. Thank you for watching. Hope you have a nice day. Adios. Thank you.